We're into the second round of the ICC Champions Trophy. So teams have played once before. They know what they've done right, but they also know what concerns they have, what issues to address. And when Australia play against Bangladesh, these are two teams with distinct issues to address. Bangladesh made upwards of 300, and the way England batted against them, it looked like they might easily score another 50. England didn't work up a sweat, and that means Bangladesh have issues to sort with their bowling. Those little spinners that do so well for them just didn't work at the oval. And so it means they either have to play an extra bowler or just hope that for some reason the oval throws up a little spongy slow track. Unlikely to happen. And so Bangladesh need to look after their bowling. You cannot go in with 43-44 overs available to you. You must have 53-54 available to you. So that is one issue to address for Bangladesh. If that means that they have to play a batsman shot, I think they'll take that gamble and back what is increasingly a pedigree top order to play out 50 overs for them. So that's the issue before Bangladesh. What about Australia? They got out of jail against New Zealand. Not only do they know it, Steve Smith has admitted it as well. And it's absolutely critical for them that not only do they win well, but they put up a dominating performance because it might well come down with points shared to who beats Bangladesh better. So, number one, they've got to get a big win against Bangladesh, but just as important, they need Warner and Finch to fire at the top because this Australian lineup depends extensively on the way the top order bats. Finch in particular, because he just seemed a little sluggish and put pressure on Warner. So, Warner, Finch, Smith get runs, then they're all right. I don't think bowling is a bit of, is, is a worry for, uh, uh, for Australia, even though Smith said that was a, one of the worst bowling performances he's seen against New Zealand. I don't think bowling is a big worry. So, the two issues very clear. Bangladesh, bowl better. Australia, bat powerfully at the top and produce a big win so that they're telling everyone else, look, we are here.